cassette tapes. They're amazing, and this video is a collection of cassette tapes from one artist, Taylor Swift. So without further ado, let's crack a lack in. Our first tape is Folklore. Now this is the blue cassette. I, I say that thinking that there's multiple cassettes for this album, but not really. So here you have the blue tape. Pretty cool. Now we're going to look at the artwork. My opinion on this album, I'm not a big fan of it, but it's a good album. Here's the track list. Um, I guess my favorite tracks will have to be Cardigan and The Lakes. So yeah. We got some black and white. Well, this is... I like this. It's like, there should be an alternate cover with this for a cassette tape. I mean, how cool would that be? Like, just imagine. Like, this... That, that's the artwork tape. Like, it, it, that, that's cool. I mean, like... I mean, would you buy a tape? Would you buy this as a tape? I would, obviously. So, yeah. That's Folklore. Next up is Evermore, the sequel to Folklore. So, yeah. Not a big Folklore Evermore guy, but that's just my opinion. And the cassette we have is, like, this gray-black. Um, Pretty cool. Hit the track list. Favorite tracks probably are gonna be j just Willow. M maybe no body, no crime feature in hand, but yeah. So yeah, the black and white aesthetic from Folklore brought on this tape too. So yeah, pretty cool. But between Evermore and Folklore, I'm pretty sure the Folklore cassette's like better. But that's just my opinion, so yeah. Evermore. Up next is Fearless Taylor's version. Now, this is a pretty cool thing because it's a recording of Taylor Swift's like second album. Here's the track list. Um, favorite tracks? Um, it's Bob. It's it's Love Story Taylor's version. I mean, it has to be. And this is a double cassette. This is on clear. Now, um, I don't know why this is this is not a gold cassette. Um, for example, here's a cassette I own of Rick Ross. See, this would be much more better, but nah, they just did clear. Let me show you guys the artwork now, because there is a lot of it. There's a whole lot of artwork for this one album, but this is a historic album. It is Taylor Swift's first re-recording in her discography. So yeah, it's pretty cool. And there's also two cassettes, which makes this pretty cool. I didn't show the tape, actually. There you go. Mistake fixed. Now, let's look at the other tape, which is also on clear. And now we're going to look at the artwork. Little ASMR cassette taping. And go off to the other side. And we're gonna confusingly fold this back up. I say confusingly because I don't know what's going on. Can you get it in there, please? There you go. Now we're gonna set the tape. So yeah. Bada bim, bada boom. Up next, we have Midnight's, probably Taylor Swift's most successful album, but that's just my opinion. As you can see, Midnight's is the Moonstone Blue cassette with some unique photos. It sucks how we got like 4 million different vinyls and CDs, but yet only one cassette, which kind of sucks, but I do like it. So yeah, here we go, Midnight's on cassette, Moonstone Blue. Take a look at the track list here. Um, my favorite tracks probably are Lavender Haze, Maroon, Anti Hero, Vigilante, Bejeweled, and Karma. 
Take a look at these unique photos. Now, what's cool about the cassette is that, oh yeah, it comes with the clock. So, as you can see, we have that. And if we look on this side, we have the rest of the clock. So, I found that pretty dope. So, yeah. Look at the photos. Put in this back. Um, I wish they did, like, the Till Dawn and, like, the Deluxe Editions put them on cassette. Um, I'm planning on making a custom tape, so if you guys want to see that when I get done making it, I haven't started it yet, but let me know if you guys would like to see Midnight's Deluxe on cassette. And now the last Tales Swift cassette I own, um, I don't have a level of reputation, is the newest one, Speak Now Tales version. I do want to say, there is no red TV on cassette. So yeah, we have Speak Now. Pretty decent album. Favorite tracks um is obviously I Can See You, the bonus track. And this one is not clear. This one is on purple, which I appreciate. They're going with the purple theme. Look at the images on this one now. Pretty cool images, I do have to say, for this album. I can't wait for 1989 Tales version on cassette, because I will be picking that up. I really like most of the tracks off 1989. On the way. You still like cassettes this way. That's how I like to do it. Now we gotta look at the second tape. This one contains most of the From the Vault tracks. Now we look at the images, gotta give credit what credit is due to tail swift who produced this mumbo jumbo all right we got the laundress gotta flip this sucker around beautiful images people really like this image i like it too now we fold it confusingly back up mm. insert the tape and that's speak now so there you guys have it, that is my entire Taylor Swift cassette tape collection, to let me know if you guys want to see any more tape videos. Until then, let me know what your favorite tape is, and smash the like. I will see you guys in the flippity flop.